Today we are going to discuss the Luke coat of arms. But before we get started, we wanted to let you know that we offer genealogy research service at our website. Please visit us at coadb.com. The first Luke coat of arms to discuss, Argent, a bugle horn, sable, string ghouls, crest, a bull's head, attired, or between two wings, endorsed gold. This was found in Copley, County Bedfordshire, Paxton, County Durham, Huntingdonshire, and in Woodend, County Bedfordshire, all in England. Sir Oliver Luke, born 1574, of Woodend, Copple, and Hans in County Bedfordshire, brother of Nicholas Luke of Paxton. They were sons of Walter Luke and grandsons of Nicholas Luke and great-grandsons of Sir Walter Luke, who died in 1544. He was of Copple in Bedfordshire, a knight, and the crest was granted to Walter Luke in 1544. Oliver had son Sir Samuel Luke, born 1603, who was a member of Parliament and an officer in the army. There was also John Luke, who died in 1638, a member of Parliament. He was knighted in 1603, son of John Luke of Woodend in County Bedfordshire. Next, it says Luke of Koppel in County Bedfordshire. So we're talking about the same family here. We know the second and third quarters are for the Lancelin family. And we know Sir Walter Luke of Copley married Anne Launcelin and had son Nicholas Luke. Another from Glasgow and Greenfield in Scotland, granted in 1749. George Luke, born 1605, had son John Luke, born 1627, of Claythorne. He was Lord Lieutenant of Glasgow, treasurer town councilman. He had sons John Luke II, born 1665, a silversmith, and James Luke of Greenfield, a merchant of Glasgow, and James had son John Luke III, born 1698. Another coat of arms, ghouls on a chief, sable, three martlets, argent, crest, and escalop proper. Prem County, Cornwall, England. Wasn't able to find this one, but it's some Lukes from Cornwall that are possibilities. John Luke, born 1736, of Trevilles, inventor of machinery for shipping and canals. Dr. Stephen Luke, born, 16, born 1763, at Penzance in Cornwall. Practiced medicine at Falmouth, Exeter, and London, and acquired Tresmaro. He was the second son of John Luke of Newlyn. There's also Rear Admiral William Luke, born 1747, the only son of John Luke who died in 1776. Argent on a fest, three fusils sable. This was found in a roll dated around the year 1490. Wasn't able to find this one. One possibility. And only a possibility is John Luke, who died in 1452, a member of Parliament for Dunwich, son of Thomas Luke of Dunwich, and the father of Robert and John Jr. But again, that's one possibility. This, this looks like a fairly old coat of arms, so it perhaps could be even older. Another said to be from Scrivetton in County Nottinghamshire. Wasn't able to find it, but it is very similar to the arms of the Leake family. Uh, William Leake married an heiress of Scrivetton. And another from Nottinghamshire, similar to the Leake coat of arms. And if you enjoyed this video, please visit us at coadb.com. Link in the description. Thank you very much.